and two lives have already been lost on the new Point Fortin Highway after a head-on collision just before midnight on Saturday. According to reports, a black Mitsubishi Lancer driven by Keegan Batiste along with a passenger were driving north along the highway towards Guapo when they collided with a silver gray B-15 vehicle driven by 29-year-old Otis Roach. Batiste and his passenger sustained injuries and went and were conveyed to the Point Fortin Hospital for treatment. But Otis Roach from Sobo Village died at the scene along with a woman in his passenger seat who is yet to be identified. Speaking with TTT News, Roach's grandmother, Donna Preddy, described Otis as a loving grandson, one who lived his life for others. You look after your little sister. Mm. Oh God, he sent you to school. Mm. He makes sure she go straight. Stand up with you right through, right through, right through. He deny himself so much things mm -hmm. just to make sure his sister complete that um, nursing, course. nursing course. And his sister, who spoke to us off camera, said she was shocked to hear the news, having spoken to him moments before his death. He got inside, he, get, he got here and brought him inside and like within... 40 minutes after I got a phone call saying that he was dead on the highway. So mm -hmm. I was in disbelief because it's like he just came home and dropped my son off. Mm. Although the highway was officially opened on Saturday, motorists were allowed to use the southbound lane of the highway due to traffic along the southern main road. Meanwhile, Point Fortin MP Kennedy Richards is urging motorists to be cautious on the newly built Point Fortin Highway following an accident early on Saturday morning. He said the highway would significantly reduce the amount of time spent to get from San Fernando all the way to Point Fortin and caution motorists to obey the speed limit. Unfortunately, we had an, an accident there sometime in the wee hours of this morning, and I want to ask the, the, the drivers, whether it be the taxi drivers or the regular community, to obey the rules. Obey the rules of the road. Leave the flying to me. Obey, <laughs> obey, obey, obey the rules, the 100 kilometers. This is not for, for racing and drag racing and whatnot. This is a, it's a strip, and we, we need to be a bit um, you know, conscious, and we also need to be a bit cautious when we're driving on the road. 